welcome to my channel Inspired Birdie for a Dollar Tree haul and let's just jump right into this. So these are just a few of the items. I do have more items but let's get started with these items first. So the first item I would say is this little container. I did take off the sticker but it was by Jot. Absolutely love this. It was in the back to school items and it has a magnet on the back. So you can put it inside a locker or you can even put it on your fridge. So really loved uh, that container. This I was super excited to find. So I already have this uh, and I use it. It is a magnet pouch and I'm just gonna see if I can zoom in here. Mind the glare guys. But you can see all of the different styles that you can get uh, and I absolutely love this thing. So I actually keep this, it's meant for I think like a locker. Uh, you can see the magnet on the back. But I actually use this on my fridge and I put all my dry erase markers in there that I use for like meal planning, that kind of stuff. You can put pens in there, but it's a really great item. Okay, so continuing on, picked up some crayons. Always love when I can find really great brands at the Dollar Tree. So these are the Disney Junior brands. This is the Mickey Mouse one. And I love these crayons because of the dual tip. So you get lots of different colors and they're just fun. I also picked up this uh, template shape. So this is a cat, as you can see, you get eight of them and it's just a fun craft to, you know, paint or put stickers on. And then there's a puppy on the other side. So I just thought that would be a really fun craft to do with the kiddo. You can either paint it or put stickers all over it. And I'm always grabbing my stickers from the Dollar Tree. I was really excited to find this and they only had one guys, which means that it went pretty fast. Uh, I looked through all of them, all of their stickers. I took them all down, went through them because I was gonna grab more of these for my friends, for their kids, but they only had the one. So this is for the new Disney Lion King movie that just recently came out. You do get over 150 stickers. I'll just quickly show you guys the inside. I think that's it. Oh no, there's one more page. I think, yeah, that's it. So super excited to have found that. All right, so quickly just moving on to some random items. I'm actually just uh, taking this video and inserting it into this haul because this is from a separate haul, but I wanted to quickly share with you guys some additional items I grabbed. So I'll just start off with this picture frame. Nothing new. If you guys go to Dollar Tree, you know picture frames. They've got lots of them. Uh, I didn't pick this one out for any particular reason. I was just looking for a four by six for a DIY that's gonna be coming out soon. Uh, but what I did wanna grab were a few kids items. So I have a birthday party that I am gonna be throwing very soon. And I wanted some items for the kids that are gonna be coming. So picked up some of these uh, Mickey crayons. And then I picked up some coloring books. This is not part of the activities. I just wanted to have a few items for some of the, the kids that are gonna be there in case they get bored. There will be some family and older children, so they may get bored for a little kid's birthday. So I picked up this fun book that they can work on different activities, crosswords, mazes, that kind of stuff. So I picked up two of those. And then for two smaller boys, I thought this would be a fun idea for loot bags because they're young and you can't really give them regular loot bag type items. I picked them up these uh, little dragon books. I thought that was super cute. And then to go along with it is this toy dinosaur. So they have a lot of cute toy animals and I did pick up two of those so they can have the same little uh, items to play with. And then separate from that, I picked up some floral for a fall DIY. I love this floral. It's one of my absolute favorites. Here's the name of it. I can never remember the name, but here it is. Oh, Mini Mums. Love, love, love. And they do come in several different colors. And then I picked up some more wall art. I've talked about this wall art so many times in my Dollar Tree videos. 
but if you haven't seen their wall art or checked it out, it is amazing. I have compared this with wall art from places like Walmart where you pay 20 bucks versus a dollar. And this stuff, guys, doesn't come off the wall. It's really, really good. And I don't mean it doesn't come off the wall as in if you want to take it off. It totally is removable. It comes off very easily, no damage, but this stuff sticks. I've been using this for about two years now. I haven't had any problems with it just coming off on its own. So I picked this one up. You saw the picture here. I love you to the moon and back. And then this one is new. I've hauled other unicorn type decor, but that is a new pattern. And this is a different brand. So this brand I'm not used to. I might have used it maybe once. I'm used to the Main Street wall creation. But I feel like I might have used this before because this type of pattern looks very similar to some of the stuff that I've used. And then I picked up the ABCs. And this is for a kid's room, like a playroom. And I thought that would be a lot of fun, especially for little children that are learning their alphabets and their numbers. And they have the numbers at the bottom. And then a few uh, final items here. Another large Kit Kat. I talk about these all the time. I always look for the extra large packs because these really do retail for around $2 at places like Walmart. So these are good deals when you can get the extra large packs. And then for my nails of the week, if you have no clue what I'm talking about, I do have a uh, video on Dollar Tree nails. I'm a huge fan of them. So these are the two that I grabbed. And then I thought this would be a really fun, uh, ha like a Halloween fall type little activity to do with my kid. So it's the pumpkin patch, create a scene sticker. And yeah, it's just like a little art project that you can do where you create a scene with all of these stickers and then you have a background. For fall items, I only picked up a few. I'm going to be checking them out again soon, but I've seen people in the U.S. call these. And I just found them finally in my Canadian store. These are the metal words, uh, which are great for anything that you want to make DIY. So these are the words here and the designs, and they're just in metal. And then I also picked this up. This is completely new. I've never seen this before. It's like that beanbag type material. And it's a bottle. And they had these in various sizes. So this is actually the smallest one that they had. They had a really large one and then one that was wider. So I thought that was really fun. And then lastly, I picked up uh, this vinyl top liner. I mean, you can use these for your drawers. You can use these for shelf liner. But I got this for a DIY project along with this uh, picture frame, this 11 by 14 picture frame and these uh, letters as well. So stay tuned for that. And then the last few items that are the craft coloring type items, stickers, things like that. I found these new uh, Disney princess stickers. So they moved them out of the sticker section into the kids section. So I've shown you guys, if you've seen my channel or other hauls, I've shown you guys that they have the Lion King. They have Toy Story, which I have not purchased, and they have the Disney princesses. So if you know anybody that loves stickers and any of these specific themes, these are really great deals. And then here's the Lion King. I did find another one, so I grabbed another package. And then I also grabbed another one of these adult coloring books. I've shown these before, but I never, I don't think I ever had the Batman one. So I grabbed this one. I've talked about these on my channel before because these are the Crayola Adult Art with Edge 
uh, coloring books. These retail at Walmart for $10. So anytime I see these at the Dollar Tree, I grab them. And then I picked up some Paw Patrol crayons for a gift. I picked up some poster letters. If you're ever looking for poster letters for work or for school, they have a lot of really great ones. So these are just the uh, yellow, but they do have various colors. And then here's another example of uh, poster letters that they have in the teacher section. And these are just like, you can't really see them. And there's a little bit of a glare, but these are bigger letters. 